You can't be serious. Bring the horse. Uh, this should be interesting. With whip cracking, cattle driving and plenty of cowboys, the film Australia portrays the image that most people picture as the vast Australian outback. But that image is under threat by a very modern foe. Technology. Ranchers across the outback are part of a trial project that uses data collected by NASA satellites to help them manage their herds. But why turn to space? An average Australian cattle farm measures around 900 square miles and can have more than 7,000 cattle. Herding on this scale means ranchers only get to see about 2% of their land on a regular basis and only manage to weigh their cattle about one and a half times a year. How does the herding technology work? Farmers use satellites to take daily photos of every 250 meters of pasture. Then they analyze the photos to figure out where there is sufficient feed for grazing. And water troughs are fitted with automatic weighing scales so ranchers know when each cow reaches the ideal weight for market. Their cattle are fitted with electronic ear tag sensors to make it easier to track them. The tags feed back information to the farmer's phones or laptops. The technology could replace costly and time-consuming roundups, leaving ranchers a little less saddle sore. For us, uh, that could be a, probably a three-day operation, I suppose, taking probably four or five labour units, you know, and potentially a helicopter. Uh, to master the paddock, so it becomes quite an expensive operation. Harnessing the technology hasn't been glitch-free. Temperatures topping 110 degrees can cause problems with the ear tag sensors and the solar panels used to power the weighing scales. Dust storms often blanket the red clay landscape, making satellite imagery useless. A more unusual challenge is posed by flocks of cockatoos that are known to chew through cables. Australia is the world's second largest exporter of beef and lawmakers and farmers think the demand in Asia could grow. Some hope that the new technology will improve farming methods and help keep up the supply. But convincing more ranchers to use it may be the hardest job of all.